Kia here with another installation in my Color Crush Rainbow Makeup Series. Today's look is going to be blue. I'm calling it the blue sky. And I forgot one of my palettes. Um, yeah, that's Harper in the background, chilling, watching trolls. All right, so as you all know, I went to work today. <laughs> so of course, the base of my face is already on. Brows, foundation, concealer. All that's already on, so we can get right into this look. I already have some concealer on my eyes, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started with this look. And my brushes are semi clean today, y'all. Of course, if my Ray Ray is always on deck, she will never lead us astray. And guess what color I'm going into? Can you get spice? <laughs> With my real technique, real techniques blending brush right above my crease. I had so many blue options that I kind of like was indecisive about what I wanted to do, but I know I wanted it to be really blue. So I am going to use this shadow from MAC called Plumage. It's an individual shade. Y'all see that? Mm. And then I'm also going to be using this L'Oreal Shadow Hip Intensity Pigment Bright Shadow Duo in Showy. So I feel like this color is similar to the MAC except and it's more teal. Kind of the same consistency. And I'm gonna be using this Smoky Palette 360 eyeshadow color, 360, 36 eyeshadow colors from Coastal Sense. But you see there's a lot of blue in here. But I think I'm gonna stick down here these bright blues and I'm also probably gonna use this brown here. To kind of smoke it out. Let's get into it. So on my lid, I'm going to apply the plumage eyeshadow from MAC. I'm going to take my shadow brush and pack that on. Alright, so all I did was Pat it on to get the color payoff and just like layer it until it was the intensity that I wanted. And then I, once I patted it on, I spread it, I spread it out to prevent uh, a lot of fallout. I'm gonna use this pointed detail brush. I call this a pencil brush because of the shape. And I'm going to use my L'Oreal Shadow Duo. And I'm gonna take this matte electric blue shade and I'm going to put that in my crease right above where I put plumage. Alright, that's in there. What do you think? Ow. All right, and now I'm going to go into my smoky palette and get that dark brown. It's like a purpley brown right here. So I have a short blending brush, you know, not fluffy. So I'm going to put that dark color just right here on the outer V and actually create a V shape. I'm gonna create a V shape on that outer corner of my eye. And blend that up and into the other shadows. And then I'm gonna take the same blending brush that I put spice on with and I'm going to blend this out because you see those lines are looking crazy. And I'm blending that brown up into that matte electric blue. 
I'm also gonna take some of this, this is like even more intense electric glue and put that on top. So let's see if that's gonna make it pop a little more. Yes. Oh yeah, Lord, yeah. Oh, oh Lord, 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 Lord. Detail brush, and I'm going to go back into that L'Oreal Duo and get this shimmery teal color. And I live for a tear duck highlight. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yeah. I'm gonna take that a little bit up on my lid in that inner corner. And I'm gonna take this fluffy blend blending brush because this is just annoying me. Try to blend that up. Right, that's the eye so far. Now I'm gonna take my take my liquid liner from Ruby Kiss, and I'm gonna line and wink out my liner. We're doing a dramatic line. Now let's hope I can duplicate that on my other eye. <laughs> prep my lashes the same ones that I used in my last color crush rainbow makeup video all right we're gonna let that get tacky so for my highlight I'm gonna use this blush palette that I made from coastal scent my first. I like this highlight, it's very subtle. As you know, this look is dramatic. All right, for this look, I do want to do a little bit of contour, and I'm going to use yeah. this. Is also from my Coastal Sense palette, Bronze Protege. My Real Techniques contour brush. Just a little bit. And for blush, I'm going to use Charisma. I like that pinky orange. It kind of um, reminds me of NARS orgasm. Okay, of course, on to the lips now. I am going to be doing a brown or a stereotypical nude lip, not my nude. All right, my lips are already moisturized. I'm just gonna take this liner pencil and line my lips. This is dark brown. And a little bit onto my lip. All right, I'm gonna be using this lipstick from Wet n Wild. It's called Bear It All. So this is almost my, my lip color. So it can be a nude, a light nude. 
for me. And I want to blend that lipstick in with the liner. You don't want there to be like a harsh line. And I'm gonna get my lip brush and just get my lip brush and just clean it up a little bit. Mm, yes. mm, this is about to turn into my everyday lip. Y'all, I forgot to do something. My lower lash line. So I'm gonna take this color from the L'Oreal Duo and just bring that a little bit further down. And I'm using my small detail brush. And then I'm gonna take this dome shaped smudge brush. And I'm gonna use that matte blue from there. I'm gonna smudge that. And then back into that smoky palette with that dark purpley brown. And I'm gonna put that on the outside, on top of the blue. Just to connect everything. Y'all yeah. see how much better that looks? I can't believe I almost forgot that. What? I don't think I'm going to line my waterline. I like the way this looks. All right, beauties, that is the finished look. The bluest eye with this nude lip. Thank you so much for watching and for supporting my channel. Before you go, be sure to subscribe, click that red button down below, and join the club. <laughs> it's free and it's easy, I promise. And if you wanna keep watching, I made it easy for you. There's two videos right over here. Go ahead and click on them. You continue to watch this makeup series, some other looks in this series, and hopefully you try them out. And if you don't wanna click that button down there, go ahead and click this picture right here and join the club. <laughs> All right, so I'll take you to my page. You can subscribe, yes. Thank you again so much for watching Beauties. I will definitely be seeing you in the next one. And also, while you're subscribing to my page, follow me on Instagram at Nikea Jalen so you can stay in the loop and be a part of my life. <laughs> Thanks for watching, beauties. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Harper says bye, too. <laughs>